Hello everybody, Marjolein here. Thanks for joining me again today here on my channel. I uh, I just have a quick show of something so adorably cute. I think, I think it's cute. And if you have a cricket or maybe a silhouette, I don't know how, uh, how it works for the silhouette, but you can probably figure that out. Mm. You should go and visit Lori Nunemaker's channel. I'll put a link in the description box for uh, to the tutorial. But I saw this over the weekend and I'm like, I have to try this. She had made clear stickers. Um, Cricut came out with uh, clear printable sticker paper. I don't have that, but... I went to Staples and there, let me see if I can find it quickly, I found, yeah, here we go, clear sticker paper by Avery, here, um, a full sheet of shipping labels, laser and inkjet, well, I have a desk jet. And it works fine. As you can see here on the label, it's totally clear. I love it. I'm like, there's 10 in here and it was, it was not cheap. $17.98 or something like that. But I was like, I want to try this. And if I can't use it, I can't, can use it for something else. That's what I figured. So I started creating... And I came up first with this one. It says thank you. And it has this cute little wheelbarrow in there that I bought from SnapClick Supply. And I made a couple of different sizes. I think this is one inch and this is one and a half. And I think... This is a little bigger than one and a half. I have no idea how, how a bit much bigger. And I think I did two inches for this one. And now it won't focus. There you go. And they are so easy to make. And they come out so adorable. I unfortunately don't have anything that I can put it or that I... Uh, put it on to show you. I just mailed something out, but let me see if I can get it off. Because now the, the backing is still on there and that is white. So, oh, come on. I had it. <laughs> oh, when you want to do something quick, it never wants to do it, right? Good thing I didn't do my nails, because then it wouldn't even work. Oh my gosh. But it's so much fun, and I, there, I'll try to put it back on. See, it's so clear. Well then, it won't focus. There we go. And it looks so adorable if you put that on, say, the back of a pocket letter or an envelope that you put something in that you swapped with uh, someone. <clears throat> well, anyways, those are the thank you ones. And then I made these ones. Made with love. And this cute flower bouquet I uh, got from Snapclick Supply too. It's part of the Hello Spring element package. So I did different sizes for that one too. One inch and um, one and a half and two inches I think. Yeah. 
man, this is so, this is fun. It's easy, too, because, I mean, I, I don't have Photoshop or any of those pr uh, programs that you can make your own designs in, and for the life of me, I cannot draw. So, using images that I bought is so much easier. And then, I decided I needed something with my name on it. So, I came up with... Handmade by me. <laughs> I could have put on there by me, but that, no. Handmade by Maya Lambusink. And this cute little, um, duh. Okay, got a blank here. Forgot how you call that, but it has all those cute flowers in there. And uh, I did different sizes of that one too. I played around a bit. Some are an inch, some are... A little bigger than an inch and one and a half again and two inches and this was so much fun to do and I just wanted to quickly show you what I uh, what I did I'll put the link in the description box to the tutorial if you uh, have a cricket and you want to try it too oh and before I forget there's still about a week and a half to sign up for uh, the spring swap pocket letter swap that I'm organizing here. Um, there's already about 17 participants, but still room enough for more. So I'll uh, link that at the end of this video. Put a link in the video so you can uh, go to the video and uh, about the swap and just sign up if you want to. So thanks for watching everybody and you have a wonderful day. Bye!